Uh, but I do want a trick board. You know what I mean? Like a dedicated trick board where you're just going to drive to a skate park and you're going to use it there. You know what I mean? Uh, you're living in the city. Well, you got a concrete jungle. The whole the whole thing is a skate is a skate park. <laughs> you know, when you as long as you don't get caught some places, right? But even at that little tiny little dinky wheels on a skateboard, I, I see kids pushing those things. I'm like, man, they must be in shape. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I remember when I was a kid. Like I say, my cruiser board, my Sims board, it had 54s on it or something like that. And I think uh, 52, 54 inch wheels on it, but they were long, right? They were, or they were wide. So they were okay, but uh, that banana board that I had, <laughs> that thing had 54s or something like that on it, uh, 56 inch wheels, whatever they were. And yeah, they were, they were pretty terrifying. <laughs> you know, they were pretty terrifying. Um, but they did the job. They, you know, they worked. Um, yeah. So again, just kind of do your research, you know, like you don't have to break the bank to do this. You don't even have to go buy a new board. You can look like, again, do like, uh, if you're on Facebook, just look at the, the, uh, what you call it, the uh, boards that are available on the, um, you know, the, the marketplace on there. If you know what you're looking for, like maybe go, go into a skate shop, figure it out, get them to explain stuff to you, stand on a few boards. If you got the money for the new board, buy the new board, but maybe look for that same board used. Uh, just, you know, find out what to watch out for, you know, like if the bearings are done in it, uh, you know, if the deck's cracked, uh, if the trucks are bent, all, all that stuff. When you buy new, you don't have to worry about that. And again, for the older people, buy a complete whatever whatever one you're going to get into just buy a complete uh building a board is fun sure but when you don't know what you're doing you're probably going to spend money on something that doesn't work you know what i mean where if you buy something and you can say okay well it sort of works for me but i think i want a, a this on it or that and then just buy what you need for that and if you're going to get a trick board, don't buy a fancy trick board. Buy something as cheap as you can get. The cheapest deck you can get. Uh, a lot of the shops will build the board for you. If you go in, they'll build the board for you. And if you're going to get a trick board, that's what I do. You just go in and buy the cheapest deck you can. Because you're going to wreck it anyway. Um, you know, and then just keep your nice, you know, later on get a nice fancy trick board that you, you take to the, <laughs> you know, take the show off once in a while. But get the board you can, you don't care about scratching. Get like the plain decks for as cheap as you can, you know, maybe like $25 deck or something like that, if you can find them that cheap nowadays. Uh, but I, I figured out I was able to build like a, a decent board with decent trucks, uh, really good wheels for about 150 bucks, And that was like the bare bones of everything, you know. Uh, and it was, you know, grip tape, uh, the, like the, a full trick board, right? And I just haven't gotten around to go and getting another one, but having a trick board up here 10 years ago, I had two of them, you know, even though they were just the, the Walmart stuff, don't go, don't go buy that stuff at all. Like just stay away from that stuff. Go into a skate shop or, or buy it used, buy good bearings, all that stuff. Good wheels. I've tried the Walmart stuff and uh, the Canadian tire stuff, and those boards absolutely are junk. You, 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 you know, like you're an adult, uh, you know, three, four hundred bucks is a lot of money. I get it uh, yeah, for anybody, but it, it's still not that much 10 years later. So, 250 bucks as a complete. This is how it came. I wouldn't change a thing on this. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, the skateboard manufacturers can usually design a board better than you can think of one. And you just have to figure out, again, read all the descriptions, what it's meant for. Look for reviews. Um, all that stuff. But yeah, like just do the, just the, you know, common sense stuff. But if you are going to get into the trick boards, uh <sighs> Be real careful with that one. Uh, get somebody, like, go find, talk to a bunch of people, even people that can train you on it, because uh, whatever you spend on your board, spend triple on your uh, pads and stuff. Like, get the hip protector, the jaw, get the, because you are going to hurt yourself on a trick board, uh, especially if you're over the age of 30 and you're not fully in shape. Uh, if you're fully in shape and you're over the age of 30, but you've never skateboarded before and you have no idea what to expect, buy the safety gear. There's no reason for you not to have the safety gear. Now, the cruisers like this, okay, a lot of times you'll take the risk and you, you know, I, I don't wear my helmet and stuff on that, uh, but I'm not doing anything crazy with it, right? 
uh, that said, and I never let it go fast enough that I can't control it. <laughs> you know, that's uh, speed checking yourself. Uh, there's several ways to do it. So you learn how to push off on the board. The next thing you need to know is how to stop it. Once you've got those two things down, everything from there is piece of cake. And then just moderate your speed. Uh, that's the best tip I can get. But yeah, if you're up there and you've never done it before, you just want to get back into it, do it. Uh, watch what it does for your day. I love a nice day like today. Just going out for five minutes on this thing. Go to the store, go back. Wave at everybody in the town. I'm like, you know, a 50-year-old Bart Simpson on, on this thing, right? And I love it. I, I absolutely love it. And I love to see people get into something better than watching movies, sitting on the internet, playing video games. This is, you know, go, go live, go live life for real. And then make videos on it. <laughs> you know, compromise, right? Um, but yeah, no, no, I, I can't recommend uh, getting into skateboarding enough, even as an older person. So I know that's a long series of videos here. I, I always do long form content on everything. Uh, it's just the GoPros, they, they cut me off at about 11 minutes or so, 11 minutes, 48 seconds, or 10 minutes and something, depending on which GoPro I'm using. Um, and it splices the video. So if you stuck with the, this long, the, the bottom line, go get into it. Uh, you can get into it a lot cheaper. And even if you buy something brand new, buy one, learn the board, learn what you can do with it. And once you feel like you've mastered it, then start looking at other boards and other styles and stuff like that. Learn, 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 and enjoy. Uh, enjoy your journey. Good luck to you. I hope you all get into it. And if you did, write some stories down below of uh, your skateboarding experience. You know, if you, you're older and you got back into it and stuff like that. Yeah, don't care what the kids say because, again, you're going to laugh at them when they wipe out. They're going to laugh at you when you wipe out. It's fair game. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you know, all that. But, yeah, I'd love to hear from you guys, too, uh, you know, your takes on the uh, skateboarding stuff and getting back into it. So as a 50-year-old man um, that got back into it about 10 years ago, uh yeah i've I, I i i wouldn't give it up you know for the world I, I love it it's it's that it's that enjoyable uh i even like this more than cycling and i love cycling i've done tons and tons of cycling uh but i even love the skateboards more uh, there's just there's a romance to it right so i don't know it just is what it is but anyway there we go so uh, have a great day eh?